Hi everyone, it's Katrina with the Pelican Girls and I went to an estate sale yesterday in a little town not far from where I live. I found a few things and I wanted to do my haul and show you what I got. Some things I'm going to sh show were from the estate sale and some I have a few things um, from Goodwill. I have one thing from Goodwill and uh, a couple of things from uh, Thrift to You, I think is what it's, it's some kind of, it's a, another thrift store. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the camera around and show you. So the first thing I'm gonna show is what I found at Goodwill. It's a little elf and he's reading a book. He is from Homeco. Let's see, let's put him like this. He is from Homeco. I am going to store him and I will list him for next Christmas. The next thing, um, that's the only thing I got at Goodwill. Our Goodwills have been really sparse, especially the one in Jennings where I went. Um, yesterday now i found this cabinet at the thrift thrift store i went to um it to me it looks like it see it's this is all like um that kind of 80s patterns that they did like the fluffy kind of folk art look and it's just a little wood cabinet it's got little shelves in it It's really cute. It opens up. And it closes. It's in good condition. I got that. And I also got this right here. These are left in China. See if I can show it on the back. Get it in the light here. Don't know if you can see that. Oh, I got it upside down. No wonder. So it says left in China, hand painted. And it has like a little crown. These are beautiful. They are very well painted. Look how pretty that is. And there's nothing wrong with them. The gold around the edges is beautiful. The paint is beautiful on all three of them. I got three of them. And I think I'm going to have these in my live cell in February. That's what I think I'm going to use these for. I'm not going to list them on eBay. But they're so pretty and I think they're like a little snack tray is what they were called because you can see the little indention right there where the cup went and you put your little hors d'oeuvres or whatever and you had your cup there is a number on there 517 too but anyway so that's the other thing that I got from the thrift store and then I went to an estate sale and I got this music stand. I'm going to spray, probably spray chalk paint, spray paint it with chalk paint and distress it back a little bit and then seal it with a poly acrylic. Cause I think it'll, I think, I just think it'll look a little bit, it'll bring out all its features and stuff, especially like at the bottom and stuff with the, um, with the, the white, the color white. So I bought that. And then I also got this, which is a vintage tin. It says Menon antiseptic borated powder on it. The graphics are great. I was looking to see, it is made in the USA. I was looking to see if they had like a date or anything on it, but 
I don't see a date on it. It's in really good condition. So that's probably going to go up on my eBay store. And then I have this, which is like a deviled egg plate. It is like in mint condition. It's beautiful blue with the gold around it, and the gold is in good condition. This is the back. The back's even prettier than the front. So I got that at the estate sale. I don't know if I'm going to keep this or if I'm going to put it in my in that live sale in February. Then I got I've got two frames here. The big chunky one right here, and then there's the gold one. I'm going to paint these chalk paint them, distress them, and wax them. Probably drop cloth white, which is a white. They're very ornate, very pretty. And this, this one right here is thick too, it's like heavy. Oh, oops. They're both made out of wood. Then I got this, I love, and I hardly, I never find pink Pyrex. And this one is in such good condition, but I'm keeping it. I am going to keep it because I never find it, never. That's a color that you never find. I'm way in the back here, I got this painting and it's already framed. It is on canvas. It does need to be cleaned up a little bit. It's by Guy McLemore Jr. and it's in 19, it was painted in 1974. And it looks like a swamp scene. An old car driven down an old road by the swamp. I'm not exactly sure where it's, where it's at, but I love the frame, which looks homemade. And I love the photograph. So I don't know what I'm going to do with it. I don't know if I'm going to put it in my, in the live cell, or if I'm going to keep it. I love it. I think it's gorgeous. Then I've got this cobalt blue candlestick. There was just one, it needs to be cleaned. There's just one, but you can always add it to your, um, Oh, it's still wet on the bottom. You can always add it to your decor. A little bit of blue. This cobalt blue is just gorgeous. And it's made very well too. It's, it's pretty heavy. At that. I got these. I love little tiny teacups. And these are in excellent condition. No chips. No cracks. Nothing. They are in perfect condition. And they are... you. Yukago, Yukako, China, ivory, hand painted, and they're from, they're occupied Japan. It has it on both, both things. Those will pretty much, I'm pretty sure these will go up. I've got two of them. Look at the pattern on this one. Pretty sure these, this one's kind of scalloped on the edge, will go up on my eBay store. I'm sorry, <laughs> lost track. The edges are scalloped on this one. That one's really cool. Those are cool. Okay, and then I got these two pedestals. And I didn't notice, but this one is cracked right there. You can see it. So, I am probably just going to use this one for whenever I um, set up things and take pictures and stuff. I'm probably just going to use that myself and when I video and stuff like that So for displays. So, I'll probably use this one. But this one right here is in good shape. So, I am going to probably repaint this one and it will probably be in the live cell. 
also got this, which is, it's like a metal shutter and it has, oops, let me try that again. It has a hook on it. So I'm going to paint this. It needs to be painted and then distressed back. This blue color will come through and um, you can hang it in just about anywhere in your kitchen, in your foyer, in a bathroom for a put robe on it just about anywhere you can put it in your de decor so that's the that might be the last thing I bought yep that does look like the last thing I bought okay guys until next time um hope you like this haul if you like these kind of videos let me know comment below um share with your friends I'm just starting this as you know um subscribe if you want to see more videos um we go to estate sales and um garage sales thrift stores flea markets all the time um i enjoyed this till the next time thanks bye